We have loved seeing all of the work that you've been doing and sending in, so keep it up. So today, we would like you in literacy, we're continuing with our story, Goldilocks and Three Bears. So we would like you to use your story map that you made yesterday to retell the story to a member of your family. And we would like you to choose a character and draw them for us and have a think of some describing words to describe them. So it might be big, brown, small, okay? In phonics, we would like you to keep practicing your phase two and phase three phonemes. We would also like you today to go on phonics play and there are some free games. We'd like you to choose one and play either phase two or phase three. We would like you to have a go at blending some words and, and play some blending activities. So we would like you to then practice forming the words and letters that you see in the game as well. And for maths today, we are going to look at number bonds to 10. So all the different ways we can make 10. And what we'd like you to do is watch a video of a Jack Hartman number bonds to 10 song. We've put a link on the blog for you. And see if you can have a look out for all the different ways they can make 10. And then we have also put up a sheet that's like this one with a part whole model. Want to see if you can maybe ask an adult to print or draw this for you. And in our whole part of the model, we've got the number 10. And we want to see how many different ways you can make 10. So for example, you might have six here and four here. Maybe you could use some counters or some Lego or maybe some sweets at home to help you work it out. And in the afternoon in our thematic lessons, we are carrying on looking at lots of different animals. So we've put a video on the blog for you to watch um, on YouTube of lots of different animals in lots of different habitats. Have a think if you can spot some of the habitats we were learning about last week. Then what we'd like you to do is choose an animal from that video. Choose an animal that has a nice pattern or something that makes that animal special. We'd like you to draw that animal and really think carefully about that pattern. Once you've drawn it, maybe someone in your house can guess what animal you've drawn by its pattern. We'd then like you to describe that animal. So for example, you might have chosen to do a zebra, so you might describe it as black, white, stripy. Have a go at writing some of the words, really thinking about all your phonic sounds to help you write those words. And we've got a special activity that we would like you to do today. So we'd like you to do a wellbeing activity. So we would like you to go around your house and find some boxes or things that you can recycle. So it might be some boxes, a bottle. We would like you to make something out of it. So you might make a um, castle out of a box. You might make a rocket using a bottle. So you can be as imaginative as you want and you can use lots of anything you've got at home to decorate it. We'd love to see all of your work. So keep posting it on Tapestry. Okay, have a lovely day. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Bye.